What's up guys this is Root from Dark Army and today we are going to get started with developing apps with React Native. Now that this platform has become quite stable and mature we tried our hands on it and developed some stuff. As we would be primarily talking about developing iOS apps with React Native you will need a Mac with Xcode installed. Go to this page and follow the instructions for iOS and Mac. The instructions were pretty clear so we thought not to explain them. To test whether you have React Native installed navigate to any folder and run these commands in your terminal. Once everything loads up and the process finishes, you will find a project named Awesome Project. Go to this folder and open the iOS subdirectory. There you will find the Xcode project file. Open this file and run it on your simulator. Now that we have the environment set up, we need to have a text editor. We started by working with Sublime Text. It just didn't work quite well for us. Sometimes the syntax coloring used to mess up. So we searched for a different one. We came across an IDE called Deco. It was great at first, with features like auto completion and toggles and sliders for changing properties. But later on we realized that it messed up our project and we had to open and close the project again and again. Also clean build it from Xcode to run it properly so we ditched Deco. At the end we decided to try out Atom with a package called Nucleide since we loved GitHub. And it performed perfectly. So we recommend everyone to use Atom with Nucleide to start with. Point to note is that these are our suggestions. If there is something better, please let us know in the comments down below. If you decide on working with Atom and Nucleide, the first step to continue work on the project is to add the project folder to Atom. Once added, you might want to know the starting point for the project is inside index.ios.js file. Everything that comes in the render method is the starting point, so the further views should be managed from here. Let's do a hello world. And there you are. As always, thank you guys for watching. We will be covering every component like list views, async storage, alert views, etc. So make sure you subscribe. This is Root and catch you guys later.